This time, which has lasted since June 24, 1981, is characterized by an event that is unique in the history of humanity, the presence of a woman who comes from the sky with a crown of 12 stars to be among us, here on Earth. An often overlooked characteristic about the Queen of Peace is that she appears to the visionaries with a crown of 12 stars. This is a very significant fact. It is written in the Bible, a great sign appeared in the sky, a woman clothed with the sun, with the moon under her feet, and on her head a crown of 12 stars. The Book of Revelations chapter 12 verses 1 and 2. We like to think that Our Lady is with us for so long to encourage the world to convert and to return to God. Of course this is why she is with us but she is also the woman of the revelation and the mystery of this has not yet been revealed. It is likely that when the time of the secrets arrives the complex mysteries and prophecies of the book of revelations will be made clear. The visionaries have described Our Lady with words that seem to come straight from the Bible. The visionaries describe Our Lady as a great sign from heaven. Maria says Our Lady comes with a crown of 12 stars above her head and she is surrounded by a special light that can't be described adequately with earthly words. Ivan says that from Apparition Hill, she leaves in the light of the cross which is as bright as the sun. The great friend of Majigori, Sister Emmanuel says the Book of Revelation is a partly sealed sacred text. It announces the fate of humanity and the victory of God over the dragon and the beast, after a terrible fight. This will manifest itself as the triumph of Our Lady's Immaculate Heart. How can we not open our eyes and see that indeed, today as never before, the fight against the beast is violent and decisive. Satan knows that his days are numbered, and he is playing his last few cards with the energy of desperation. Our Lady wants to tell us that we are in a key moment, a significant turning point in the life of the Church. A time when the realization of the Apocalypse is near and when everyone will have to take a stand, to be with Christ or against Christ. This is why Our Lady is imploring us to be firm in faith and to be ready. She is asking each of us to participate in the victory. On May 2, 2016, Our Lady shared a unique message revealing that we each have a role in the biblical prophecies of the Book of Revelations. She desires us to be her apostles of the Revelation. She said, Dear children, my motherly heart desires your true conversion and a firm faith so that you may be able to spread love and peace to all those who surround you. But, my children, do not forget, each of you is a unique world before the Heavenly Father. Therefore, permit the continuous working of the Holy Spirit to work on you. Be my spiritually pure children. He comes to you and breaks the bread with you, because, my children, for your sake he died, he resurrected and is coming anew. These words of mine are familiar to you because they are the truth, and the truth does not change. It is only that many of my children have forgotten it. My children, my words are neither old nor new, they are eternal. Therefore, I invite you, my children, to observe well the signs of the times, to gather the shattered crosses and to be apostles of the revelation. Thank you. Our Lady is calling. God bless and thank you for watching Mystic Post TV.